Thank you all for being here. This is a big day. It's been a long time coming. We've been talking about this for about 12 years. It's been the longest conversation I've been in since I've been here. Um, before we begin, there's a number of thank yous I want to give out today, but before we start, I'd like to call upon Reverend Rockmore to give us an invocation. Reverend? Our heads bowed. Most gracious Heavenly Father, we come thanking you today as we celebrate the groundbreaking for this new parking garage. We thank you for those that are here celebrating with us as well as those who send their well wishes. Lord God, we also thank you for this space and this opportunity and all those involved to come in agreement and use this for the uplifting of your city and county. We ask, Lord, that you bless this ground, which is already yours. Bless the equipment operators, bless every worker, team member involved, because we know that without you, nothing is possible. All these things we ask, we thank you, Lord, for what you've done, what you're doing, and what you will do. For it's in Jesus' name we pray and ask it all. Amen. Thank God. Thank you, Reverend. First thank you that I want to say to is the people of Gray County that got out and voted for this project. Thanks to Gray County voters, this project is going forward. And I thank the Gray County voters. That's the biggest thank you. The other thank you I'd like to say is the unanimous decision by the commissioner's court to support this project. There's been a lot of discussion about which way to go and how to do it. At the end of the day, the right decision was made and the public confirmed it with their vote. And I thank the court for being unanimous on that. Thirdly, I'd like to thank the people in the parking committee for their work and dedication. This is something that's been being worked on for probably the last three to five years and more so in the last three years. We're really getting serious about what we wanted and what we wanted to visualize what we wanted to have when it was all said and done. We wanted to add to the beauty of this great county courthouse campus. We wanted to add to the viability of downtown. And I think we've done that. And I think you'll see when the finished product is done, hopefully 15 months from now, you'll agree. I'd like to thank our purchasing department, Kelly Davis. She has worked numerous hours, days and nights in putting this all together. I'd like to thank our auditor, Rebecca Akers, working with the financing, put this all together. I'd like to thank the sheriff, Sheriff Sroniano, who's given many hours to the security aspect of this project and his wisdom. And I'd like to say a special thank you to Ronnie McKinney, Commissioner McKinney, for being the leader and the cheerleader behind this project on the court. This has been his, his, his mission for a number of years. And he told me before he left office he would get this thing built, and he did. And I give him total congratulations for that. I want to thank, thank Mr. Boston for his leadership regarding giving it to the voters. It was Commissioner Boston that made the recommendation we go to the voters. And I want to say, I want to thank Commissioner Wingo for the second. He seconded the motion. And I want to thank Commissioner Craig for supporting the motion. Because all these people together made all this happen. I want to thank the Long Beach Chamber of Commerce for their endorsement for putting this project together. I want to thank Hilltop Securities for arranging the financing with John Martin. And I want to thank the architectural firm, Schwartz Hansen, Brad Nauer back in the back, who designed this, this building that you'll see, hopefully in the next 15 months, that will clearly change the view of downtown Longview. And thank the Almighty God for the support that he's given to me and to the court to see this to fruition. So having said all that, I think we're ready to break some ground. 